What's going on, everybody? It's a beautiful day. We're here working in the yard today at the house at the Coliseum. And we bought a house some of you guys might know a couple years ago. It had a pond right up there. And uh, it's a beautiful yard. Someone spent a lot of time and money. Call it the Coliseum. Someone spent a lot of money digging all this out, putting all this stuff in. It's beautiful, really nice to look at, but it is a lot of work. And we've had a lot of drought here in Ohio and amongst many other places. But uh, I wanted to let you guys know, if you are considering buying a house with a pond, there's maintenance. And especially if you have fish or if you have frogs like we do, um, you don't want to dump a lot of chemicals in there because it might kill, kill them off. So instead of dumping a lot of chemicals and trying to get this water, look at this water. It's green, yucky. So we're pumping it out, thanks to Dave and Jackie. I don't know anything about the stuff and they do. They decided to come out and help us out here on Saturday. And so something to consider, because I put, put it on Facebook what we were looking to do. We were trying to clear the pond up and a lot of people reached out. Thank you to everybody. We did do some more additional research and decided, you know, if you just give something chemicals, it's just gonna, I don't know, I'm not a scientist, I don't know about this stuff. So we decided to just do the right thing, pump all the water out, clean the pond out, and then we're gonna refill it with brand new fresh water. And we've got the fish we're gonna be taking out of here. We'll show you guys progress pictures as we, as we go. Um, but something to keep in mind if you're buying a house that has pond or a lot of vegetations, you know, it needs water, it needs maintained. And uh, thank you guys that reached out and expressed expressed knowledge and willingness to contribute. So we'll show you guys how this process goes, how the fish like it. And one, of the, one other thing to know if you're an owner occupant or if you're a, I'm sorry, if you're a homeowner and you've got water. All right, guys, have a great day. Save the froggos.